spent half my life looking for the reasons things must change. Rockin Rocking this, uh, it's not new. This is an acquisition from 2020 from Goodwill acquisition. But folks, you're gonna love it. What I got packed in here. This is a beer drinker slash whiskey drinker's dream. All right, folks, got grandma on the scene. Okay. Yeah, Flo, you're gonna look good in that backpack, baby. I'm showcasing your beauty. I'm showcasing the backpack, so if I wear the backpack, nobody will be able to see it. Plus, my my gear right here is a little heavy. Huh? Folks, it got me a crew today. All right, let's roll. We ready to roll. Go for it, G. Walk it out, buddy. They look just like our shine walking by. Let's go, everybody. Look at this crew. Been down this road before, folks. Y'all joined us on last week's video. Fatima. Wait, wait. I've observed that Fatima is carrying nothing. You don't need a whole... Well, get your Skinners on that 50-50, that bag up there with your sister. Flo. Flo, let your sister do 50-50 on that bag. Yeah, do. Wonder Twin Powers, activate. Now, that's my, that's my beautiful ladies. And folks, you're in for a rare treat. Fatima put her hair down today. Good job, Fatima. Got Maria Mercedes being Little Red Riding Hood. <laughs> Good job, sweetie girl. Flo, can you do me one favor? Put your hair down. Match your sister. Just put your hair down. Come on. Run the twin powers. Activate. These beautiful ladies. Come on, ladies, go to work now. Put your back into it. Oh, baby, back. Oh, baby, there's four kilos of shrimp in there. Eat. Listen, are you are you ladies concerned about my arm holding this camera? Now, Flo, I've observed that you're now you're not carrying anything. Folks, you see the stress I'm under here? Got the young Kuya here. Bye, you mind looking so beautiful today. Extra now, now you got proper village skills, baby. Now I'll give you, I'll give you some props. But your mother is balancing that. Honey, your mother has no hands. Maybe the technique is your your aerodynamics are out of whack. You need to put it in line like your mom's cut down on the wind resistance what folks you're about to witness two kilos of shrimp and a kilo of fish go tumbling down like my beer what three kilos of shrimp one kilo of fish three kilos of shrimp one kilo of fish about to hit the ground five kulafos five oh five kulafos in there folks y'all see the stress i'm under here you see this, this bag that I'm carrying? That bag is armed with uh, the picnic pack. Got a bottle of liquor, two Cokes, two uh, wine glasses. Life is wonderful. But I got one question for y'all. Can a brother get a table dance? Can a brother get a table dance? Man, it's a hot one today. <laughs> hey, they had Kalafu on sale at Prince. It was like one peso off. It was like 39 and a half pesos, so like 40 pesos. 
you know. Out here in the village, it's 52 pesos. So I just loaded, loaded her dad up. I think I got five bottles of Kalafu. Thanks to you, the viewer. Thanks to y'all sending the Super Chat funds. We certainly appreciate it. I know y'all said to uh, fire up the village with balloons. And we were going to, but they were out of balloons at Prince. And we used the balloon budget money to buy more shrimp. But we've got a great idea. We're going to do village games. Not today, but it's coming up. We're going to set up some village games for cash prizes. And there's going to be balloons involved. Look at this crew. Flo, why don't you got something in your head, baby? Now, folks, what y'all think about my twins, my Wonder Twins? Wonder Twin powers activate. Uh, Flo, can you carry that cooler for my daughter? It looks like she's hurting her arm over there. Put, put your, yeah, put your skinner on that, Flo. It's a beautiful day in the sugar cane field. My goodness. Just look at these views. I know this little camera is not going to do it any justice. Not going to do it any justice. Some people ask why I'm not filming on the FX3. Well, when you're walking and talking, unless you put that FX3 on a gimbal, uh, which is very heavy, it's not that type of camera. For walking and talking, you got to have something with a lot of built-in stabilization. That's why I'm shooting on the DJI Osmo Action 4. Every every camera is, has a specific purpose. You know, every tool is different, right? I'm going to tell you right now, it's hot out here. It is hot in this sugar cane field. But luckily, we got a nice cool breeze coming through. A lot of cheese was going on back there. I have no idea what they're saying. I don't speak beside you. A little different angle on the dangle. Folks, this, this, uh, this pole that comes with the DJI Osmo Action, the damn thing's like five, six feet long. I mean, you can like make it look like I'm shooting from a drone, but I just got this thing on this pole. Cheers. Ladies, stepping out behind schedule I need some ice and my cokes my cokes are getting warm dig, dig, dig. let's go ladies dig 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 <laughs> oh my goodness I'm gonna upset the feminists hey look look at look at my muscle strain you see how how much uh, muscle power it takes to hold this camera I gotta put these 26 inch pythons Oh, baby, my shoulder is starting to get a little strain. Can you carry my bag for me? Hello. Huh? Goy. Come on, baby. It's not oh. heavy. How <laughs> I mean, you love me enough to carry this carry this bag? Huh? That's not heavy. It's not? Okay, well then carry it for me. Yeah, <laughs> 
Where's the hat? Where's the hat? He's in his hand. <laughs> she can't she can't look down. Baby, you lost your shoe. <laughs> your shoe's untied. <laughs> Alright, now y'all might think this was an asshole move, right? And I'm gonna run ahead around this corner. I'm gonna jump out. I'm gonna scare if I do mind. See if she can keep three kilos of shrimp and a kilo of fish on her head. I don't think it's gonna happen. But hey, I'm in the entertainment business. Get me in here. Here's no cobras. By a fucking cobra, that wouldn't be good. I'll get down, get down, get down low, stay low. They look, they're looking for me. They're looking for me. Don't hide in there. Don't hide in there. <laughs> 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 you saw my hiding spot. Yeah, uh, yeah because the cool you told so on me. Huh? No, you're so big. Maybe there's only one thing about me that's big. What? In there? Oh. That no? <laughs> Look at those! <laughs> what? Look! Wonder Twin Powers, activate! But see, I told you, if you turn it like that, it's more aerodynamic, Fatima. Your sister, your sister still has her village skills, you have none. See? Folks, I mean, it's all about aerodynamics. Now you're, you're, you're cutting through the wind. Before, she had it on the top of her head back there like a sail. Look at Grandma, it just cuts through the wind. Just like uh, Augustus Gloop, the oceanographer. <laughs> Baby, you remember uh, Jacques Cousteau? <laughs> whoa, 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 easy, easy, greasy. There's three, there's three kilos of shrimp up there. Grandma, these ladies are getting lazy living with a foreign guy. Hello, I'm going to showcase your beauty. <laughs> Don't laugh, you're going to drop the shrimp now. Don't drop the shrimp, baby. And two cokes. Drunk again, huh? Drunk again. You drunk again, well. You will crawl in the river. Life is good, my friends. You know, I take the time to say thank you again for watching our show, watching, uh, listening to my voice, everybody who sends super chat money, funds on the back end. Y'all make this life possible for me, and I certainly appreciate it. I really do. You make all this possible. So today, it's a Saturday. And you know, it's kind of crazy. I had it I envisioned to go on Sundays, right? After church. But for some reason, they want to go on Saturdays. And I'll, I'll be honest, I, because they, what they try to do, they try to damn sleep all day Sunday. That's what they try to do. That's their vision. Their vision of Sunday is to sleep all day. 
my vision was to go to church and then go eat in the village. It's okay, it's morphed into a Saturday thing. The only bad thing about that is that, okay, say you go to the beach on Sundays here in the Philippines, it's very crowded. You know, families go to the beach. And so I wanted to go to the beach one day. So if we go to the beach tomorrow, it's just gonna be very crowded. Where if, if we went on Saturday, it would be less crowded, then we could go to the village on Sunday. Doesn't matter, but it is what it is. Plan never survives. First contact, my friends. But everybody is happy. Everybody loves going to the village and uh, just spending time with the family. Yes, it contradicts a lot of things I've said over the years. But don't get confused. If you are a single bachelor, okay, life for you is better. Uh, you know, being be, be, be near a city, Cebu City, Manila, Makati, um, Angeles City, Subic. It's better for you if you're a single bachelor, right? If you have a girlfriend, just a girlfriend, don't live anywhere near her village. I mean, hell, there's 3,000 pesos worth of food in that bag right there, right? And if you're on a budget, um, how does that benefit you? So, you have to understand my advice. You're single, you got a girlfriend, whatever. Your girlfriend's family lives in Cebu, you live up on Luzon, or you live in Palawan, right? But when you're married and all of a sudden you have children, the dynamic changes. Okay, is that selfish? Yeah, but it's ground truth. Okay, no. Living down here with, when we didn't have any kids, how does that benefit me? Uh, it gets old really quick. Food options are limited. Um, don't get me wrong, I love her family. But it just wasn't the lifestyle I'm looking for. Now it is. Now it is. I'm getting older. Got these children, they love coming to the village, they love living in the country. So the advice st stays the same. It hasn't it hasn't changed that much. It's just if your situation changes um, to where all of a sudden you're not a bachelor, you know, living by yourself and your girlfriend, well, okay, then the advice changes. There you go. These folks out here working in the fields. underneath this hot sun planting the sugar cane and basically they use that stick sort of make a hole and then put the small about six inch six inch length of sugar sugar cane into the ground and that's what these bags are for right here these bags and the bags that are laying out everywhere have the uh, sugar cane in there so i'll just kind of show you there right there that's what they plant Man, I'm just trying to show my viewers how sugar starts. Okay, That's they take that, time. they put it in the ground, and then it grows, and then eventually it gets, eventually it gets put on a boat and gets to your table as a sack of sugar. Hello, hey buddy. He's like, why the hell are they messing with her? Sugar cane. So that's the problem with these two. They never worked the sugar cane field. You don't even know which way to plant the sugar cane. Okay, get out there and go to work. My viewers want to see you work, baby. Don't don't let them fool you, folks. They, their father did not want them to work the field, so they stayed home and slept most of the time. All right. Coming up on our famous danger crossing. Okay. Okay. So one, you, you, okay, so if you, hold on, wait, wait a minute. If, if you put 100, 100, 1,000 pieces. 100 in the ground, what's the payment? Huh? No, 1,000 in the, if you put 1,000 pieces in the ground, you will just pay 100 pieces. You get 100 pesos. Folks, you put a thousand of those in the ground, you make two, uh, 100 pesos. Careful, Fatima.
Whoa, whoa, flow easy. Watch the trees. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Easy. Watch the trees. Whoa. Baby, I'm trying to teach her jungle skills. No, no, jungle. That won't be, huh? My gosh, folks. I'll just follow Grandma. Honey, he's got a, something in his foot. Check his foot. See, look. Y'all saw this last week? Old single dad just takes it low and slow, baby. Low and slow, old single dad. Just wait. There's something in the tree here. There's something up in this tree. I gave you a closer look over here. I think there's a monkey up in the tree. Nah, no, ain't no monkeys here. Look at that beautiful right there, right? Absolutely beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. So basically, I gotta, I gotta come over here and just wash the mud off of my feet. That's what I should do. I should start a jungle school here in my wife's village. No need to go to Hawaii or it used to be down in Panama. You just come here to my wife's village for a week. You'll learn more about the jungle than the U.S. Army could teach you. Saddle up. Let's move out. Move him out for us, Jay. Honey, check his foot now. He's, I think his foot's hurt, baby. Yeah. Check his right foot. What happened? There's something in there. All right, we'll check him. Check him. All right, hold, everybody hold up. We got a man down. Yeah, he's got a cut right there, baby. How did that happen? You're not going to get mother of the year if your boy's got a cut on his foot. No. Filipino mothers are rough on the children. Come here, son. Can you walk, man? Can you walk? Let's check out his foot. Honey, his foot's hurt. That's what I get. Bump. Let's go. He needs to learn. Gosh. Okay. Come on, buddy. Papa's got you, man. Your mom's rough on you, but Papa help you. Come on. What we got up there, ladies? What we got? A snake? Ladies, what we got up there? All right, let's see it. Hold on. Don't scare it off now. I got to get some footage. I got a man with a broke wheel. I got a snake. Where's the snake, baby? Baby, where's that snake at? So we got a snake in the, in the, the crocodile slash carabao poop mud puddle here. I don't see no snake. Now, come on, son. Come on. Walk it out, buddy. You chilling like a villain? Papa's got you, man. You want me to carry you? You okay? Papa, carry you? Come here, man. Come here. Come on. Papa, get you. Okay, Papa's got you, man. Papa's got you. We'll fix fix your foot. Oh, whoa, your foot when we get up to the village, son. Goat poop all over trail. Ay, yeah, yeah. See the stress I'm under here. Yeah, he cut his foot just a little bit. But the mine's not going to win the mother of the year for her actions, but in a sense, she's right. Hey, this is life. Small cut on your foot. Tough it out, man. We're in the middle of the sunshine here. Okay? At least get to the shade, then we'll take a look at the feet. But better just to get to the village and we'll take a look at it. Okay. Out here in the open. Sunshine beating down on us. Not the place to stop and try to set up camp and do assessments. Damn. Y'all can't see what I'm seeing, but I'm basically dodging piles of poop. Whee! 
from Carabao Poop and the Goats. Oh, Lord. Papa's got you, buddy. <laughs> Love you, son. Man, I wouldn't trade this day for anything, folks. Oh. I think his backpack's what's making him heavy. Got a little red sled right here. Unoccupied. Why don't you buy a car, you cheap? Good job, mother of the year, giving your moral support, yelling for the boy to keep walking. Good job. Thanks for the moral support, uh, Fadima. <laughs> Come on. Want to do piggyback for us, G? Get on your mama here. Okay, here we go. Yay! Yay! What about that mud? Come on, get on there for us, G. Good job, Fatima. You didn't win Mother of the Year, but I give you Mother of the Day. After my expert tutelage on how to parent the children, now you understand what's important. Let's go, baby. Son's making me sweat. Dig, 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 old girl. Dig, dig, dig. Maybe you're no match for old single dad. Oh Lord, you took off like sea biscuit. Got a lot of muscle in the. Let me get up here, and get on these ladies here. Let's go, ladies. <laughs> Flo, I'm out of beer, baby. I'm out of beer flow. I mean, we're, we're in a bad situation now, girl. Critical mass. Folks, don't flow look so beautiful. She's so pretty. Wow! 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 You want me to carry that the rest of the way, baby? Oh. Here, all right, let me do it. All right, y'all want to see it? Here it goes. Grandma, I've been drinking my, my beers. Folks, everybody want to yak me for the first part of this video. Why are you making those beautiful ladies carry all that shrimp and them fish? Hey, sometimes you got to lure out the handsome donkeys. A donkey hunter. Got a woman down over there. Number two back there. About the, about the hurl. She, 
She's giving up a 55 peso shoe pile. Oh my god, that was expensive. Oh, I need a gun thing. The device overheated. Out of the way, you dubbies. Little baby cow. Almost to the village. Oh my god. Put it here, oh. There. Ayo. Ayo ka na. Ayo. Da baka. Uy. Uy. Folks, just like that. Uy. Just like that, we're here. Yeah, no. But now how to get this off my head. Grandma, help me get this off my head, baby. Tang tang, ko ada mo. I don't want to spill it. <laughs> I, didn't make it I didn't mean for you to have to climb. <laughs> uh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, go ahead and take a rest, baby. You were you were throwing up on the trail, losing your village durability skills. But you look beautiful today, especially with your hair down. My goodness. Okay, so I know everybody's excited about seeing. Now you may have seen this before. But I think, honestly, this is the first time I've used this thing. This is the first time I've used this bag. This is a Goodwill acquisition from 2020 in America. It was brand new. They'd never used it. This didn't appear to be used. But it was brand new. And it's a wine. They meant for wine, right? Wine and cheese picnics. But, instead of a bottle of wine, what do I have in here? Old Captain. Got an old Captain. Hey, buddy. Hey little oop pal. Hey buddy. Hey buddy. Did you bring the cl the clay dough? Yes, sir. Okay, good job, Maria. But Opa will eat the clay, Daddy. Okay, we well, just watch him. You have to supervise him, okay? Make sure the babies don't eat the clay. Look, got two zippers here. Very durable. Now this is was purchased for romantic picnics with Filipino wife number two. But see, you open this up. Look at her. Fits two Cokes perfectly. Whoa. Okay, just a minute and Papa will make you a drink. We're going to have a picnic. I guess I'll turn it around. No, it's not cracked. It's, it's, it's supposed to look like that. It's plastic. Well, maybe, I don't know. No, it's supposed to look like that, I believe. But yeah, so see, you got you got two two glasses in here. You got two glasses in here, strapped down, right? And a couple of napkins. And I've got a beer opener here. And I added that. It didn't come with that. It come with the. Well, yeah, you can open a beer with this. It came with the wine, the corkscrew. I added a uh, extra beer opener and an extra corkscrew. So I guess I've got two corkscrews and three beer openers. Isn't that cute? I mean, you could like put some cheese and crackers down in there, but it is perfect. A perfect piece of gear for coming to the village. Lovely. And again, it was a Goodwill, a Goodwill acquisition. This is the first time I've ever used it. Matter of fact, I'm gonna go wash out the glasses. My little mermaid. What are you doing over here? Hmm? You're sitting on the edge here. You could fall off. That's okay. As long as there's someone who will catch me. Yeah, yeah I Baby, hide a couple of these. Just don't don't tell them that we brought five. Put these in reason. Yeah, put put two. Put one in the backpack because when they want one more, then you can go get one more. Right? <laughs> yeah, you go. No, no. Keep three out. Yeah, just hide those two. Hide those two. You gotta you gotta throttle them. Hey, you gotta know how to manage drinkers. Okay. Thank you very much, darling. Welcome. Yeah. <laughs> Yummy. <laughs> Check this out. We got shrimp today, baby. Look at the shrimp. Huh? We are blessed with some shrimp and some fishes. Okay, Maria, come on, sweetie. Let's go get some coke, okay? 
Life is good, my friends. Man, life is good. These little plastic wine glasses. Nope, that won't break. It's plastic. Well, plastic will break, but no, it's not glass, sweetie. It's plastic, okay? Okay, me and you have a little picnic, okay? Where you buy this, Daddy? Uh, Papa got this in America. Oh. I was shopping at a place called Goodwill, Ukai Ukai, and I found this. I was shopping with your grandma. Can I had some. Yes, ma'am. Ready? You have like a little tea party, huh? Just me and you. That's enough. That's enough? Yes, sir. Okay, pop up, pour some in here. Hold on, we do a toast, okay? Hold on a second. We will cheers, Daddy. Yeah, cheers, Maria. Cheers, sweetie. Hey! <laughs> yes, ma'am. Life is so good. Sitting there having a little tea party. Careful, sweetie girl. So last week, we saw the gentleman bringing some corn. He didn't get to take a look at it, but they're, they're drying the corn. Okay, go ahead and pour you some. This is a nice little picnic pack, huh, Maria? So... We should just put some cheese and crackers in there. I mean, you could go to the beach and have a picnic. You like cheese? I like cheese. I like cheese. I do too. And you got your Play-Doh, your Clay-Doh? Yes, sir. I have to Play-Doh. Okay, hold on. Let's pop them. Wipe your face, okay? There no, we go. Chloe don't have Play-Doh, so I shared with Chloe. You shared with Chloe? Oh, yes. you're so sweet. You want some chips? No, sir. It's, it's corn. What are these? Big Munch corn chips. You know what? Let me try one of these guys here. Hmm. Is not that bad. Yummy, Daddy? Well, not really, but not exactly Doritos. Mm. Cheers, sweetie. Cheer. Cheer. <laughs> Cheers. Yeah. There you go. Only thing we need is some ice. Big Daddy got to get some ice. Y'all saw it last week. Same. Got me a bottle of Old Captain. Plenty of Kalafu for the gentleman. And I use where, that term lightly. Where, where's Tita Waro? Tita Ramel? I'm not sure. I'm not sure where uh, Tita and Tita Ramel are at. Tita, Tata is in the, in the house. Oh, he's in the house? Yes, sir. Okay. Did you see Ati Mai Mai? Yes, sir. Folks, Ati Mai Mai. Ati Mai Mai on the scene, folks. All right, Ati Minda, how are you? <laughs> Cheers to you, my friends. Captain and Coke. Well, old Captain. Old Captain Coke. Look at my ice. Look at my ice supply. Oh yeah, I'm in business. You know what? Let me get work on the presentation. I think this should go over here. This should be in the foreground. Oh, whoa. Product staging, folks. Stage these products. Oh yeah. Look at that beautiful napkin. <laughs> Yeah, get some chips. Hey man, you okay? How's your foot doing, buddy? You say bye, Papa. Mm, I love you, man. <laughs> Folks, I'm 107. I'll just put these videos on up on my 100 inch plasma or whatever it is hologram TV and I will watch these moments and just cherish them. Well, I'm over here in the cooking operation. 
<laughs> what we got going on over here at the mine? Chopping the vegetables. Yeah. And deveining the, the shrimp. Deveining the shrimp. Awesome. Awesome. Abante <laughs> secretary. Yeah. Look at this crew, folks. <laughs> <laughs> over here with the picnic set. Good job, bud Ro. You need some ice? I'll probably get you some ice, man. Freshly chopped wood. Sitting out here to dry. There you go. That's for cooking right there. Of course, you dropped a carrot. Let me give it to these goats over here. Oh, man, it's a video of poop coming out the cornhole there. Here you go, Mr. Goat. Yeah, yeah. Did he see it? It's in reach. He'll figure it out. My supervising as usual. Not much uh, work out of her. Got grandma over here on the rocket stove. All right, Grandma, how we doing? Yeah, get that fire going, folks. Cooking the rice. Got the clothes. And they're still working on these shrimps. Check on my little mermaid's technique here. Folks, you don't want to stick your fingers in this group. You might get them chopped off. Beautiful little tunas, huh? Hey, secretary, ikay ikay kwa na isol ba ni kadi ko kabaw unsa yung kwan? Hindi ko mukha. Here we go. That's it. Oh, she's coming in here with the oyster sauce. Oyster sauce, yeah. Then working on the carrots here. Yeah, Fatima is observing as usual. <laughs> Oh, you got did you give your father some kulafu? Hey, the, the, the man is over here moving huge rocks. Hurting his back. He might need a little, a little Christmas cheer. Just give the man some Christmas cheer. Oh, these ladies are rough on the dudes here in the village. What can I do? Yeah. <laughs> get supply of wood, you gotta keep the wood in stock. But grandma in the flow. Right, the ladies are directing the father on where to put these rocks. They're not concerned with his back at all. <laughs> That's a heavy ass rock. My back hurts just watching him move the rocks. But then, why don't you help your father move these rocks over here, please? Dude, the man, the man is. I don't know how old, but folks, I can help, but. Who's going to hold this camera? Who's this? Who's going to be Steven Spielberg? If I ask this one to film, she'd be pointing the camera over there. No action. I didn't realize old tiger's over there. My grandma coming in here with the pot.
A lot of discussion about how this pot's gonna go on here. You have a better bird's eye view of this discussion. These kids are jumping the mud hole again. That's sort of entertainment. I'm not encouraging it. They were doing it before I got the camera out, so I'm not at fault if somebody gets injured. Right, folks, last week, last week you saw Tito Ramil go to work and start the fire. But this week, Grandma. Mm. We're probably going to help out a little bit. It's okay, buddy. Good job, man. Good job, son. <laughs> hey, uh, ask your mom whose house did she steal that lumber off of? <laughs> and here comes Tai Tai in here with some more. Baby, is this from the old kitchen? I, I was joking, but I think you're serious, right? This is this is wood from the kitchen that fell in, right? Hey man. I love you, but stop grabbing them carrots, buddy, bro. Come on, hop down. There you go. Hey, are you blowing on it or smoking that pipe, old man? Right, baby, do it one more time. Let me get some more footage of that. Go ahead and blow on that pipe, baby. See if you can get a tune out of that trombone, baby. Good job, Fatima. Good job, baby. Good job on those skills. This chicken comes. Why do these chickens always come check out the fire? I don't know. Every time we start a fire, chicken gonna come check it out. It's your destiny to get on that fire, Mr. Chicken. And of course, G loves rice. That's the Filipino side of him. He loves rice. He doesn't cry like he used to for the, for the rice. Uh, every now and then he gets mad if he don't get no rice. But hey, he's half Filipino. He lives in the Philippines. You can't stop him from eating rice. So he loves it. Just put a little soy sauce on there. He'll go to work. Who's creeping in here? Hey, Tito Romel. Hey, buddy. Folks, we got Tito Romel on the scene. What's up, buddy? How you doing, man? You doing all right? All right, buddy. Come on in, man. We got some kalafu over here, buddy. Tito Ramel, the singer, folks. <laughs> Come creeping in from the fields. Hell yeah. They still have a few more to go here. Chopping them, chopping them up, but. Look at all this. Huh? I can't hear, baby. I can't. Whoa, easy out of there, baby. Get that. Whoa, whoa. 
She always get she always getting them apart. Baby, get out of there. You picture on. Oh no. You picture on go up. Man, balis na lang pulsa. Hey. How much did you get? Okay, folks, at the mama about to go to work. Throw some oil up in there. Hey, where's the oil we brought? We, we bought some oil. I don't know what happened to it. Good job, sweetie. All right, folks, I think my mom coming in here with the garlic. Boom, shaka laka laka. Get there closer, Father Man. It's so all in one seasoning granules. Everybody here cooks with magic syrup. Everybody wants to know what it is. Um, I banned it in my house because they cook everything with this, right? And it's just the same old, same old, same old. Same as, uh, you know, soy sauce and salt. Um, I should be dropping carrots in there. Boom, shaka laka laka. Where are we going, son? Where you want to go? To the basketball court? Know where he's taking me? I'm just following him. Careful, Papa's got you. Come this way. You come this way. Come on, come this way. There you go. Just walk on the grass. Hmm? You can do it. You can go back. Okay, jump, jump. Hey, good job, Forest G. Good job, buddy. Where are we going, man? I'm not sure if the basketball is over there. Sweet boy, Papa loves you, man. Whoa, takes off like a seed biscuit. Beautiful corn over here. Yeah, we got some people in the basketball court. <laughs> Papa's coming, man. Folks, you see this beautiful tree. It is so cool under this tree, and the canopy is mostly at the top. All right, you got the kids over here shooting a little hoop. Come on, son, let's play basketball. Hello, everybody. Hello. All right. Show them how to shoot a little hoop. Super tall dude like me, folks. I can, pl I can play some basketball. Come on, son, let's go play. Let's go. Father of the year, man. <laughs> We're running. He fell down, folks. Got a little boo-boo here. All right, let's go get it washed off, buddy. Come on. Come on, Papa. Papa's fault. Folks, he was just running. He was just running. Fell down. Skin, skin up his knees. But it happened on my watch, so I got to go back and tell the old lady, I ain't going to win father of the year. We'll take him down to the well and get him cleaned up, get it washed out. So, so, he left back, Romani. I right, go to work, baby. Go to work. Blow on it, baby. 
Get a tune out of that trombone for the mouth. Let's go, baby. Can I tell a lie? I'll be honest with you. <laughs> Let me hold this for you. You want to hold the camera down? Yes, sir. Okay, come here. Get a good grip on it. Come here. Hold it. It's heavy when you go. <laughs> good job, sweetie. Is it heavy? No, sir. Okay, well, you hold it there for 20 minutes while me and Tita talk. So, Flo, what's been going on in your world? This been going to school? Yeah. Flo's been going to school. What else? Nothing else. Oh, you went to a wedding that you didn't invite me to. Last name of Tita is and, and you're supposed to go to a birthday party coming up, right? Yeah. Next. Am, Daddy, I, am I invited? You have mud over in your feet. Yeah, that's because I've, I've got mud in my feet because I'm in the village. So, I'm not invited to this birthday party? Let me hold it. Okay, well, hold it straight. Hold it still. Like this. Right there. <laughs> so, when am I going to get invited to something? I will go. Huh? I'm just invited them. There's this thing called plus one. Do it. Emo. Shake and bake. Oh yeah, look at that. Look at that folks, look at that. Okay. Action. Action, not the mind mine. Hello. Can you run to Bacow and get some butter? Go to Kyle Wick quickly. It's like a low country brawl right there. Babe, just run up run to Kyle and get me some butter. You know why? Because I'm worth it. <laughs> <laughs> that shirt, sweetie. It's Sports That's Forest G shirt. That's comfortable, huh? Now you're nice and cool, right? Papa needs one of those. Teamwork. Baba, 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 Di na man hinun mo tawag og duyan swing na may tawag kahilas <laughs> Iya na siya swing mama swing mama Ay, Oh di na man duyan tawag Kahilas na lagi si upaw na Ha Oy oy No 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 upaw no 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 no, 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 ini <laughs> 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 Hoy, kurang mo ko. Tangtang na lang nang usa ka kuan nang tayo kana para para ipaubos na lang ba? Ano kana lang kana? Ano na yung nasa kuan? 
Million dollar grill, y'all. Million dollar grill. Look, good narration. They grill the fish so that we can eat. Grandma! Baby, I heard it. I heard that you want one of them yellow gas stoves. Oh, yes! You sure? Sure! I thought you liked cooking on the wood. You want a yellow stove? She like that. She like that. Alright, I'm gonna I'm gonna bring you a yellow stove, okay? Okay. Alright, Flo. But you gotta carry that big tank, baby. Flo gonna carry that big tank on her head. Hey, like this, baby, like this. Carry that big tank like that.
Tak berantas uan. Tarah. Okey.